I invite you into a time of prayer, a time of reflection, a time of settling in and of connecting. In this hard time, in this time of confusion and struggle, of possibility and wonder, we reach out and we reach out and we reach out wider, deeper, to find the source that is large enough to hold all of it. And breathing, we find that web, the net that will catch us all, even when it feels like we are falling. There is a net that will catch us all. There is a web that is life itself. And so gently, tenderly, we place into the knowledge of that web all of those in need of our care the injured, the sick, the lonely, those who have been abused and brutalized and put down, those who are incarcerated in unsafe conditions, those who are housed in unsafe conditions and those who are unhoused. In this net, we tenderly place our own broken hearts, our own fears for what is happening and what will happen and into this net, we tenderly, tenderly place our hopes, our understanding of the possibilities, our commitment to seeing how we are all together held in this net of life, of love that will not let us go that will not let any one of us go. This net that is large enough to hold our outrage and our anger and our grief and our love and our joy and our hope and our promise that is always embedded in the fact of that net, in each and every node of connection that holds us all, that has been holding us all, that will always be holding us all, in that web of life, we wrap ourselves, we wrap our beloveds, we wrap all of life, every last bit. And so we say, may we all be held in the heart of love. Blessed be it, amen.